cloud storage. Who hasn't heard about that? So there are so many providers, I really cannot count them with my, with my bare hands. Now, in this video, we look at six different cloud storage providers. Yes, six. And we are going to unclutter the cloud a little bit for you. If you want to know more about cloud services and apps, please visit cloudwords.net and subscribe to this YouTube channel for more awesome tips, tricks, and reviews. The services we review in this video are top contenders in the field. In this video, I'll have a look at Mega from the infamous founder of uh, Mega Upload, Kim.com. You might have heard about him already. Google Drive, OneDrive from Microsoft, Dropbox, SugarSync, and SpiderOak. You can find all the info in our article on cloudwords.net by clicking just here. And there's also a nice comparison chart that shows you all the nitty gritty details that you need to know to find the best provider for your needs. So SugarSync is the only service that doesn't offer forever free cloud storage, but you can sign up for a 30 day free trial. And the rest of the services boast basically a lot of free storage, starting from two gigabytes for Dropbox and Spider Oak, well, until 15 gigabyte for Google Drive and OneDrive to incredible 50 gigabyte for Mega. So if you combined all the services, you'd get, you'd get 84 gigabyte of free storage, and that's a lot. Mega is a cloud storage service which uh, offers secure end-to-end -end encryption and secure collaboration. You'll have mobile apps, a synchronization client uh, to use Mega in a Dropbox-like fashion, and even email and a chat client. What makes Mega stand out, well, at least this is what they claim, is that they provide a high level of security. When you sign up, they create a 2084-bit RSA public-private key that should keep your data safe. And save means that, theoretically, nobody else but you has access to your files, not even the authorities if they, if they wanted to, because the keys reside in your computer. And did I mention you get 50 gigabyte for free? Well, yeah, you do. Now, the paid tiers for Mega start from $99.99 per year for 500 gigabytes. Chances are you already know and use Google Drive. If you've been using Google Docs for a longer period of time, your account is transformed automatically to a Google Drive account where you'll get awesome 15 gigabytes of free storage. Drive documents and minor resolution photos and videos do not count towards your quota. And if you need more space, you can get 100 gigabytes for only $23.88 per year. Google Drive is just a great tool for collaboration, especially when, uh, when working with, with a lot of spreadsheets. For example, when creating standard operating procedures for your team, or if you're just uh, working out on your weekly grocery shopping list and expense tracking, that's a great tool for that as well. Now, let's look at Microsoft's alternative to Google Drive called OneDrive, formerly called SkyDrive. Similar to Google Drive, OneDrive provides 15 gigabytes of uh, free storage and its referral incentive is a minimum of 500 megabyte limited to 5 gigabyte. Office 365 users get one terabyte of OneDrive storage as part of the monthly subscription fee, which is uh, the latest addition to the offers provided by OneDrive. However, last October, Microsoft promised uh, offering unlimited cloud storage for Office 365 users, so that's a lot of storage as well. OneDrive's mobile app is excellent. It provides the option to browse through files, um, create folders, and look at thumbnail previews. It also displays the files in a list where you have the pleasure of uh, smooth file management practically. So you can uh, swipe left and you will get the option of deleting files. Uh, you have uh, buttons uh, provided across the app that allows you to sort by backups, by recent files and types of documents or documents shared with others. And you can enable file sharing from the menu button, which um, also allows you to add more files if you want. Now, Let's look at one of the services which are at the forefront of uh, cloud storage services, which is certainly Dropbox. Dropbox has made the concept of cloud storage practically 
accessible to the public offering two gigabyte for free and back in 2007 that was a huge amount this was a huge deal and today well that looks kind of stingy but you can invite friends and increase your uh, free storage amount to up to 18 gigabytes and sometimes there are special space races uh, offered as well now dropbox's user experience is just great and the service uh, is is very fast what makes it a perfect cloud solution for me is that it integrates nicely with third-party apps such as password management, uh, password managers, to have all files available on all your devices wherever you need them. And personally, I use one password to sync my passwords, and I highly recommend you do that because it's just great to have your passwords anywhere you go. You can get uh, one terabyte for nine dollars and ninety-nine cents per month. Let's look at one of the major competitors of Dropbox, which is SugarSync. It's the only cloud storage service, at least that I'm aware of, that has an option of customized pricing plans as per customer requirements. And this is, well, basically my favorite file synchronization service because it has a little more features than Dropbox. And, well, it offers a free 30-day trial before requiring an upgrade to a paid version. So there is no forever free storage, which is a shame, but the 30-day free trial makes up for that. What's great with SugarSync, in my opinion, is that you can get multiple syncing folders as opposed to Dropbox. I've been using SugarSync for quite a while now, and the mobile app um, is, is really great, and I'm super, super happy with it. It's fast, and it's responsive, and I can access my files basically where, wherever I go and determine multiple uh, synchronization folders. So the pay tiers start from $74.99 for 100 gigabyte. If you require more storage, you can sign up for their, their business tier, which go up to one terabyte. The last service I like to add to this comparison is Spider Oak. And Spider Oak is something special because it focuses on security. It offers a so-called zero knowledge privacy, which essentially means that you are the only one who can access your files. This is achieved by creating an encryption key that is on your computer and not uploaded to the cloud. And Spider Oak lets you sync your files just like Dropbox would and also create uh, so-called scheduled backups, which makes it both a backup and cloud file syncing solution. And that's pretty neat, actually. It makes it unique. The user interface is a little clunky, in my opinion, and not very intuitive, but overall, it works very well. You can get one terabyte for $9.99 per month, which is a steep decline in their former price point, which used to be at $9.99 for 100 gigabyte only. Well, speaking about uh, security, all services are fairly secure because they encrypt your files during transit and on their servers. However, all the services except Spider Oak or Mega could potentially see your files because the encryption takes place on their service with their keys. Now, the NSA could force them to expose your data. It's just uh, to keep that in mind that not all services are secure as they claim to be. If you'd like to see my uh, top 10 secure Dropbox alternatives video, yeah, you can just uh, click here and watch it right now where I go a little bit into detail about the security aspects of using Dropbox or other services. And remember to subscribe if you like the content you see here. And if you have any questions, I'd be more than happy to help. And we see us in my next video. Bye-bye.